Hey everyone, it's Erica. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a process video for the Bella Boulevard creative team. I'm going to be creating a winter layout using this adorable holiday collection, but it does have some winter elements in there. I already have this cut file backed. This is from um, the cutouts, and so I thought that I would go ahead and use this because it was sitting in the box with the collection. So I have that backed, and I have some photos. I have four black and white photos of Liam uh, making snow angels, so I thought that I would punch them out with circle punches and then frame them with some circles and kind of just do some type of design going down the center here of the layout with the circles and the photos. I did pull out some of the winter elements from the collection and then I have the puffy stickers as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started and then um, speed this up and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I have a piece of white textured cardstock trimmed down to 11 and a half by 11 and a half, and I've matted it onto two pattern papers from the Bella Boulevard collection. So this um, darker teal color is 11 and three quarters by 11 and three quarters, and then matted onto the 12 by 12. The cup file is uh, adhered in the center of the layout, and then I have some stitch circles that I die cut. Um, the stitch circles, I believe, were from Echo Park, and I'll link them below. And then I just have my photos matted and then put on those. So I'm going to lay them out some way on the layout, and then I did die cut some smaller circles that I will place around the layout as well, and then uh, go in and add different um, embellishments around the page. And then I do have the puffy stickers and then the... Um, epoxy stickers and then I do have some die cuts that I do want to add around the layout as well and then I will add something with the letter scramble alphabet stickers I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put or where I'm going to put it I might just do maybe something around each little circle but I know that I want to add those in as well and then um, come in with some of these die cuts and just kind of place these around the layout in different places I pulled out a bunch of different um, die cuts. I love this freezing season, so I might put that there in the center of that circle. And then I do have some Christmas trees and some florals that um, I'll kind of play around with as well. Just some different, here's some more little circles that I can place there. There are these little snowflakes that I will probably put around the page as well. Just kind of scatter them around these little cute little bunnies that I'll probably add in here somewhere. I just think they're adorable. Oh, the little snowman. Oh, I might have some of the, I'm gonna look on the chipboard and see if there's something in there that I can use as well. But I love that snowman. And I was hoping there's a blue tree in here, but there's not, it's just green, which is totally fine. But there is another snowman here, so I might pull him out and exchange those for the snowman. I don't know if I'm gonna use this, I'll probably take that off. I'm just gonna kind of play around with some of these die cuts, see where I want them to go. So I need to adhere everything down and then I might put something down here or something up here. And there are some small little circles in here as well that I could add to the page and there's some other trees I can add in. So I'm gonna play with the placement of everything, get everything stuck down and then I will be back. Okay, so I'm going to start to get everything adhered down. I do have some of the die cuts laid out onto the layout, but I'm going to move things around and then you'll see where I end up putting everything. I am going to move the trees um, from the, the title Joy there and I'm just going to end up putting some floral bits around the J, the Y, and then I have a large floral that will go uh, behind the freezing season on the O of joy and then I'm going to embellish around some of the circles that have the photos and then just sprinkle a couple of the uh, puffy stickers around the page and then I also add in some of the epoxy stickers as well it came together very quickly um, I, I 
like knew in my head once I had the circle sound kind of how every how I wanted everything to go I knew the title would go that large title would go in the center which I absolutely love it's really easy to put a layout together using these cutouts so once I had that down in the circles then it was just really easy to kind of decorate the page with all of the pretty embellishments I love that die cut there the reindeer so I wanted to put that in there as well even though there's no reindeer on the page um, I just thought it was really cute kind of sticking out from that freezing season and then um, I'm going to take the letter scrambles in, I think I have peep. I wish I would have taken either red or the lighter pink. Um, but anyway, I ended up using peep, which is totally fine. And I just put it under joy. I just spell out winter and then 2022. And then I'm going to put that right under joy. And I do use one of the epoxy reindeer stickers. And I put that next to the winter uh, title as well. And then at the end, I have still shots for you guys. I will leave the link to the blog post down below for you as well. So if you want to head on over to the Bella Boulevard blog and check it out, you can see the photos close up there. And then I will leave the collection link down below for you. I will link to scrapbook.com and also a cherry on top. Yeah, here are the still shots. I hope you guys enjoy the layout. Make sure you head on over to the Bella Boulevard Facebook and their Instagram for even more inspiration using this collection. And I will see you guys in my next video. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye.